Let's talk about a new way you can make some pretty decent money. Get a lot of empowering stones. Hey, little Bolivians, it is Sister Card here. Hopefully, you all having a great day. I'm having a great day. We're back today in World Zero because we're going to be going over a way that I briefly talked about in my update video when we got 9 2 released on Friday, and I nobody listened. And another content creator made video on it, and I feel like there's nobody listening. So I'm gonna make my own version of it, and uh, we're gonna go explore that. So if you have not already, please make sure you smash, smash, smash the lovely like button, do the same subscribe button. I greatly appreciate it. Helps me a lot. And uh, let's go get some empowering stones, and let's go get some money. So the dungeon I'm talking about is going to be nine two. So there are two items we can get in here that are kind of really important: the ether crown and empowering stones. And I'm also talking about the level 121 i'm not talking about the nightmare one so one thing to note with this dungeon it is incredibly short and like you can run through it in about two to three minutes especially if you have maxed out gear but what makes it broken especially for getting money is the fact that this rushed ether boss has a chance to drop an empowered stone there is actually two locations in this entire dungeon that you can get empowering stones which means this very short dungeon that is relatively easy to complete has a chance to net you two. And they are currently selling for about on low end 150 up to 500,000 gold on the market. Which means every time you get one, you've basically made a quarter to half a million gold. And if you manage to score the crown from the final boss... Not many people are actually farming for it, so you would actually be able to get it and possibly sell it for upwards of half a million from what I've been seeing. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to run through this for an hour. I'm just going to run through the entire dungeon for an entire hour, see how many I can get. I'm not even that fast, which that's fine. I don't really need to be for this. I just need to get it done and not die. So I will see y'all in an hour. And just for context, this is how much I'm starting with, and I already have one gem. So, woohoo, Ether Crown. And another one. Let's go. Alrighty, our last one. So, it's been about 30 minutes. Or about an hour, sorry. It's been about an hour. Um, And we'll go ahead and go back to the lobby, and I'll kind of show you all the gold we have. We'll go to the market. We'll put everything up on the auction house, or for people to buy and uh we'll see how much we get okay so just in gold alone we made about two hundred and thirty thousand. uh our original number was let me type it right here so that was the original number that we started with so we've already made 230 gold now i got two stones and we got two crowns so what I'm going to go ahead and do is put those up on the market. I'm going to put the stones up for 300,000, see if they sell. And I'm going to put the crowns up for half a million a piece. I do have some other items in my shop. So uh, we'll see what gets sold. We'll see. I'm a little interested. So I managed to sell the three empowering stones for about 800k altogether. Someone wanted to buy them, so I priced them all the same. Uh, wasn't able to sell them for 300k. Thought I'd be able to, but I mean, that's still a pretty good profit. Uh, by the way, thank you, uh, Josh Lobster. Thank you. So, uh, I mean, we're almost at a million gold. So, by the way, I want to add that when I was doing my runs, I had several moments that I lagged really bad. So, I probably could have gotten another two to three runs in and had more chance to go get some more stones and to go get some more gold. Now, I do want to preface this that, of course, prices are going to change. Demand's going to change. So this trick, once tower comes out, may not be viable anymore. So I would just recommend doing it as soon as you can. All right. So finally, one of the crowns sold. I priced them for about 300000 So it finally sold. So we actually are officially over a million gold. Uh, we're getting really close to a million and a half that you could earn in that hour. And mind you, I was slow. And we're not going to talk about why my outfit's like this. Mind you, I was slow. 
if you do this in a group, it'll go a lot faster. Of course, if you have max gear, it will go a lot faster. Uh, I have 115 gear. <laughs> I just wanted the I need money. I'm broke. So FYIZ, if you see a random person that looks like this in the shop, it is probably me selling stuff this week because I am severely out of cash and I need to upgrade my gear, and that requires the monies. So uh, I may be selling some empowering stones this week, so if y'all want to come check it out, you're more than welcome to. Uh, if you see that I'm in game, I'm either running dungeons or I am selling stuff in one of the shops. So, Plebs, thank you for making it to this part of the video. A million gold an hour. Real easy. Something anyone can do. We'll see y'all next time.